I have some news for you all, for the world here. For me, for me, I wish to compete here in Moscow, Russia. We know that. This is known. We know what belt I am seeking here in Mother Russia. The people of Russia deserve this inevitable rematch to take place here in Moscow. And it will happen. However, I am not waiting around for that man. That man is a known pullout, a known, a known fe fear of risk. He does not take risk. So for me, I am not waiting around. I would, I would like to announce to the public the return of the notorious Conor McGregor will take place on January 18th in the T-Mobile Arena in Las Vegas, Nevada. So that is my comeback fight. It is 12 weeks this Saturday. I'm in prime physical condition. I have agreed the date with the, uh, I have, I have agreed the date with the company. As far as the opponent, I have the opponent's name. But for me, I, the game I am in and from experience, if I was to give you people the name, which I would love to do, I know the UFC would flip it because they are, they are a crafty company. So for me, here, here's this one. Ask the UFC who the opponent is because I do not give a fuck who the opponent is. January 18th, the return of the notorious Conor McGregor, 12 weeks this Saturday at the T-Mobile Arena in Las Vegas, Nevada. I mean, me and Donald have had a history for a while, right? And I did say I'd fight him. If you, if you look at the list of call-outs or the people that I've engaged with, Donald was probably one of the first ones. So he's first on the list and that's it. And I'll get to every single one of them also. Why exactly is this fight at 170 pounds? I mean, there's a lot been said about it. It raised a few eyebrows when it was announced. Why, in your opinion, is this at 170? Well, it's first of all, it's what I weigh right now. You know what I mean? So <clears throat> uh, what's, the, what's the lightweight title fight on? Is April, is it? April or March. So why cut, cut weight to that? And then likely something will happen there. So I'll be ready to slot in for that belt. So. Um, I'll just have a fight, a good solid camp at 170, with no weight cut, a good fight, I know Donald's a good fighter, great, great records, most knockdowns, most head kicks, um, most fights, most rounds, he's got a lot of UFC records on, under his belt, so I'll get a great camp, a great fight, and then it'll take me uh, into the year. I'm looking at this as a season, so this is the beginning of the season, Donald was the first one that I agreed to have a bout with, and here we are. Oh man, he uh, did everything he said he was going to do, didn't he? So, uh, any feelings? Yeah, he's fucking great, man, and I'm honored to share the thing with him. So, uh, we'll see. We'll see if at 170 I'm still a fucking stick in the mud, huh? <laughs> <laughs> yes. Good man, good man. As we're training, as our coaches... That's one hell of a coat, Donald. My God. <laughs> I got to give credit where credit is due. Right. It's, you know what I mean? I don't know whether you've outdone me. I've got lions on the inside. I'm my baby here, you know what I mean? But that's a damn good coat, brother. What is it now? Was it crocodile or? Ah, it's uh, python. Python, good so I'm man. Sure, I'm sure. I'm sure, Peter, <laughs> I'm sure Peter might be here because I got uh, rattlesnakes uh, on and python. So they, it might they have be. a warrant there for me as well, Peter. They're coming <laughs> for me too. But I used to rock the python shoes a lot when I done the ultimate fight with your eye of fame. But it's a good skin. But you know yourself, yeah. we don't want trouble with Peter. Although they have their, they're a shady crowd as well. Apparently, there's a lot of. Sh we'll get to that another day. I'm with you. I'm with you. Um, Fuck, I don't remember what you asked me, but... Uh, uh, do you think at all that he's looking past you in any way? No, I do not. I think, oh, our, our, we prepare to be to beat our opponent at our worst, right? So for him to say he's got the flu, whatever, good. I fucking hope so, man. I hope you're ready. I hope you're ready. Right? Because I'm coming. He knows it. He's coming. This is going to be... We're going to blow the fucking roof off this place, you guys. You don't understand. I'm so excited for this fight. So excited. Thank you. Oh, I was excited to sit back and have a chuckle. Um... I just don't know what he's going to say, you know, or what he would have said. You know, you lost your last two fights, I'd have been like, yeah, <laughs> and? You know, couldn't really talk bad about me being a good father or a good role model, so I don't know what he would have come at me with, but um, I was ready just to laugh. I wanted, I was hoping, I mean, he's, he did good. He still had his witty little charm, and I think the press conference threw everyone for a loop, and it was good to see him become a, he has such a, an awesome platform. Why not be a? good role model, why not be a good person? So it was cool to see him sit there and the same thing I've been preaching my whole time, like, man, you can steer this vessel any way you want. It's good to see him making the right path, man, I like it. Oh, there's still pressure here, right? There's still, there's still weight on the shoulders, so um, I enjoy it, I enjoy these moments. This is what I, this is what I love to do, right? So it's good to be back. Um, it, it's a different re uh, response between myself and Donald, but it's still a high intense bout and Make no mistake, I'm coming with all my intent and all my, all my skills to put Donald away. Four bonuses, one, four fight night submission holds more records than anyone. 
Official weight, 170 for Cowboys! And his opponent, the former featherweight, the former lightweight champion of the world, the great Connor! Official weight, 170 for Mr. McGregor! Ladies and gentlemen, I'm here with Donald Cerrone. Cowboy, this is a giant fight, a fight so big. I mean, it's one of the most important fights ever that doesn't have a world title behind it. Give me your thoughts on what this means to you. Oh, this is incredible. We're going to blow the fucking roof off this place, man. I cannot wait. Everyone says I never show up. This is the fight to show up for. I cannot wait. I can't wait to watch. Good luck to you, sir. Donald Cerrone, ladies and gentlemen. The Notorious, ladies and gentlemen. First of all, Connor, it's great to see you back, and it's great to see you motivated and excited about this. Give us your thoughts on why this fight means so much to you and what it means tomorrow night to fight Cowboy. How good do I look at 170? Yes, I feel real good at this weight. I'm coming for all of them in this division. It begins with Donald. Let's go, I'm excited. Thank you all for the support. Thank you for coming out. I apologize, I'm a little late. It's hard work getting the kids ready and bringing them to the events. So thank you all for your patience. You're in for a great show tomorrow night. Tomorrow night, I'm dedicating this fight to me, Ma, back home. I love you, Ma. We all love you. Conor McGregor, ladies and gentlemen. Thank you, everyone, for coming out. We'll